Hello everyone, if you are here, you must be a handbag lover. How many handbags do you have in your collection? So currently I have 16 bags in total. But do you ever wonder if you have to downsize and only keep the absolute favorites? Well, not necessarily favorites, but essentials, which ones you would pick? Um, so I decided to challenge myself and think about what if I can only uh, pick three from my collection and just keep the three I always use, uh, which bags would those be? So let me show you uh, what they are. The first bag is from WP Standard. It's their backpack. You have seen this quite a lot. I've had this for more than two years, and this is my uh, go-to bag for daily use. It holds my laptop, and it's a bag that I feel it's stylish enough, but also looks um, somewhat professional and very comfortable to wear. All other backpacks um, I have sold, I tried a lot of the leather backpacks, but they are just too heavy for me to carry my laptop and other essentials. Well, this bag, uh, I think it's really good quality, but also lightweight enough. And I do like the style a lot. The second bag is my uh, Longchamp La Pliage Tote. I have this for a very long time. I think I first got it in 2016, and it's still holding up really well. I do travel quite frequently, either for leisure or business reason. And this is the bag I always bring when I travel. Or even when I'm not travel, if it rings outside, this is the bag I bring because it's waterproof. So I know I don't need to worry about um, the outside bag getting wet. I can easily wipe it down. And this is the, I would say this is the only tote that I can realistically use. Because I do feel like a lot of totes tend to get heavy, uh, especially the design of a lot of totes has really thin straps and it can dig into your shoulder uh, when you carry a lot of items. And this nylon bag is the only one that I can realistically uh, use as a tote when I have to travel with my laptop or and additional items inside. It's big enough to fit a lot of things but also super lightweight. And when I need to go to conferences or I need to somewhat look more professional than bring a backpack, this is my go-to. So this is the second bag I would keep. And lastly is um, this wide crossbody bag. So this bag, I would say is the one that can change. I just I know I need a um, small crossbody or grab and go bag or even for um, dinner or other occasions. And this bag fits, the other, fits all the criteria. However, this is not the only small crossbody bag or even the appropriate bag in my collection. I choose this one because this is the only white or light color bag I have where all others are pretty dark. So that's the only reason why I chose it. But I have another one uh, I definitely like as well. It's from Dean's Accessories based in um, California in the US. And this one is Coach. So my third pick is any of these small crossbody bag or even the appropriate bag. So with all that said, these are the three um, handbags. If I can only keep three, then these are the ones I use all the time and these are the ones I absolutely have to keep. However, I do love handbags and there are actually three fun bags I have to share with you. And although I do not reach for them all the time, I think these are also in my permanent collection because how fun they are and how unique they are. The first is from uh, Nana and Co. So it's their uh, sling bag. The, the sling bag design is not new. Every brand probably has one sling bag. What's unique about this bag uh, and what draws me into it is the embro uh, embroideries. And every time I look at it, it just brings me so much joy and it's so unique. 
even to this day I still uh, love it a lot and it's actually more func functional than I initially expected I can easily wear this uh, on weekends um, and going out so this is my in my permanent collection and the second bag is from uh, rough and tumble so you have seen this bag before um, this is their purple party or party purple um, the star is borrow I think it's a smaller version however I would to say the reason why I love this bag is not necessarily the style although the style is really versatile because it can be carried as crossbody bag shoulder bag and a backpack it's really the color <laughs> it's such a fun purple color and I don't have any bag uh, with this fun color in my collection so this is a perm items as well also the inside is metallic silver um, lamb skin I believe so it's just a really fun and good looking bag the last perm bag I would have to say it's a close um, battle between two bags one is the rough tumble small pillow and the other is a satchel madre in the size midi the reason why I got these two bags were because of the um, color I love the Bolte color a lot uh, this I would say it's kind of like a, a ocean, a deep ocean blue and with a great sheen to it and this is an emerald green color which I absolutely love so you will notice all my fun bags in my perm collection they are colorful ones because I do love color a lot However, I may not necessarily be able to carry them on a daily basis. I still enjoy having them in my collection so I can use them on weekends. And it definitely brings me a lot of joy. So tell me three bags you use all the time and what else are in your perm collection. Thanks for watching the video. I'll see you next time. Bye.